and as a bit of a guide, the Paralympic record for the 1,000 meters is 108.919. The world record is 105.912. Marcia Fanhani, seventh in Toronto last year in world championships on the track, is also a road racer, and some of her best performances were also at uh, Toronto, finishing at seventh in both the road race and time trial out on the road. And we will also see Ferreira competing in the individual pursuit uh, as well as this time trial event and the road race and road time trial as well. So the road racing program begins in the second week of these games. ideal start there but it is very difficult working in the team to time that start with the opening of the gate they've overcome that and now they're settling in so a reminder there are four laps of the track here the four laps of 250 meters and all eyes on the clock so let's have a look at the early benchmark for 250 meters it's 25.460 so they're gaining speed, trying to reach as quickly as they can to that top speed and power on through, coming up to the two lap mark of four. 500 metre mark, let's check in there. So at the halfway, it's 43.376. As Marsha Fanhani just tries to tuck in behind the pilot, keeping the aerodynamics as high as possible and now really trying to lift up the ante, even though the fatigue is starting to set in at the 750 metre mark. So the cheers of the crowd, the locals really getting behind Marsha Fanhani as they come around the turn, the final thrust towards the line, one more lunge, one, 22.354, the time for Marsha Fanhardy from Brazil. And I do wonder how much that start may have cost them. However, they did quickly regroup, and it does seem that this pair has really enjoyed the experience in front of the home crowd. Certainly, the crowd really got behind them for the final two laps of that performance. An average speed of 43.71 kilometres an hour, and the first time posted of date...